Long, Lieutenant Hudson, and General Ganey, the CG of Space and Missile Defense Command. Air defense is not one at all. It's also that we are one of the less fit branches. So what would you say uh, to a cadet to debunk this thing? Well, first thing I would say to the cadets is there our lieutenants are put in a position that no other lieutenants are put into, specifically in the short range air defense arena, where our lieutenants are standing in front of infantry and armored task force commanders during NTC, JRTC, and deployed environments, essentially highlighting and, and delegate what they're doing as air defense uh, officers that no other, no other uh, lieutenant is doing so significant opportunities for young lieutenants in the air. My question is, uh, what uh, career paths uh, within air defense artillery offer the most uh, in terms of uh, opportunities for growth and development, especially when it comes to leadership and specialized skills? Yeah, so you all are lucky right now because you have more opportunities than I had uh, coming uh, through the military. And I thought I had a lot of opportunities because when I came up, I started as a short range air defense uh, platoon leader, transition to Patriot battery commander. Those were pretty much the two paths. But now if you look at the opportunities you all have, you can be a short range uh, air defense platoon leader, maneuvering with the division. You can be a, what's called an IFPIC uh, platoon leader, shoot down cruise missiles and drones supporting the Corps. You can be a Patriot platoon leader, shooting down tactical ballistic missiles or cruise missiles, and you can be a THAAD uh, battery uh, platoon leader. So the opportunities are enormous uh, for you all. Now, as we modernize to IBCS, you'll be able to do all of that on one console. So several opportunities within one unit because of our modernization. I was wondering, sir, could, if you could speak about uh, the strategic importance of air defense, what kind of conversation are you having with other civil leaders, how important our branch. Yeah, so great segue into what I did in my past job and what I'm doing now. So in the job right before being the Space and Missile Defense Commander, I was the director of counter drone capability. Uh, so when you talk of the strategic landscape, you have to start with the way drone where warfare has completely changed the way we're doing this. If you look at what's going on in Ukraine, uh, Israel, and our soldiers in uh, uh, CENTCOM AOR, Drones are pretty much dominating the headlines. So when you look at from a strategic landscape and vision of the air defense branch, and what I forgot earlier on your question, you can also be a counter drone platoon leader because now we are putting counter drone uh, batteries inside of our divisional uh, ADA uh, battalion to create more opportunities. So when I talk to senior leaders, you know, I've had an opportunity to uh, brief Chief Staff of the Army in the last six months, two occasions. And, and both of those occasions are how do we fight integrated air missile defense as a single system? Because as the threat is, I talked about drones, but then when you mix in the cruise missiles and the tactical ballistic missiles, all being shot at you at one time. So no one system can defeat all of that. So how do we fight as a single system? That's through our integrated battle command system. So when I talk to our strategic leaders, our senior leaders, I talk from a modernization perspective, we in the air defense branch have the path forward that's gonna allow us to not only apply a layered defense, but a defense that's capable of getting after a range of threats integrated into a common C2 as we move forward. Thank you so much. Cool. Oh, thank you. Really thank you. No, I thank appreciate you, it. It's great to talk to you. Thanks for everything that you all are doing. I tell you, phenomenal. You all being out here uh, this week. You are, Reverend Page, I tell you, you all are the faces of the branch. And I tell you, the branch is bright. So you are very bright.